Right, hello everybody, welcome to Vampire Pro Tips, game number 8. Uh, down TV against Norse. Uh, pretty annoying, because they're going to have lots of block. I'm going to have a wizard though. 14th, I mean this is day 2 of the ladder by the way. This is day 2 of the ladder. Um, the ladder's only been open for about 26 hours. We, we've both played, seven, he's on 610 as well, we've both played 7 games. Down 100 TV. He's got two mighty blow players. He's got a dauntless runner. He's only he's got a throne and a runner. He hasn't got two runners. Uh, he's got a block yeti. <laughs> Space cadet diced. Okay, he has. I'm not on this team, which is which is disappointing. But he's got Rick Reckless, Artemis, Sky Blue Jumpy, and Sky Blue Monty and Jumpy Jim. But um, he's got what two dodges? I've got no tackle. Which is going to make my ball sacking not so good, isn't it? And uh, he's got two mighty blows. He's got dirty play. Loads of frenzy. How many players? Three, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve players. Twelve players. He is armor seven, so maybe I'll get lucky. But I've got the bolt for the sack anyway. So. Oh god. Oh god. Norse. Oh. Fingers crossed. Norse dead team is already here. Neither of us have lost. Neither of us have lost a combined record of 10 wins, 4 draws and no losses. Both with uh, very variable teams as well, isn't it? 6-1-0 Skuro. 610 is his record, and uh, I'm regretting going down to 13 instead of having 14 now, aren't I? No, oh, I hate chainsaws. He did get blocking his yeti. Lucky dingo. Right, kick. Right, where's the movement guy? Move bust guy, where are you? Move bus guy wants to get punched. And five SPP guys on the bench, so they don't die. Minus movement guy, more in the, more central, so he doesn't have to use his movement as much. Two, two, zero. Zero in the least protected spot. Block on both sides. I guess this way is better, so that the two, the two, the the best vamps on the side with uh, less shit. Right. Fingers crossed. I just need, I just need to fucking turn him over and score on on his drive, and then no matter how much he wrecks me, I might be able to get a draw out of it. That's the plan. Oops. Hello. Yeah, four three zero Skuro. Agree to draw no there's gonna be no collusion goblin six. It probably is, yeah, Mr. Lollis. It probably is, isn't it? Because they've got the frenzy to get the knockdowns and they've got movement as well and strength. It's pretty horrible. He doesn't have sure hands. So he might fail a pickup and stuff, which is good. But yeah, Norse are rough. I fucking hate Norse. I absolutely fucking hate Norse. Hello, I'm too noob for you. What I think's funny is, vampires are like the definition of dicey. Oh, here we go. Vamps are like the definition of dicey, yet yeah, it's it's like a quite a consistent record, isn't it? Four wins and three draws. The record the record looks looks consistent, but it's been anything but it's been fucking crazy dice. Could do anything in lots of games. Fucking Norse man. There's no one needed though.
Yeah, they just get more knockdowns, don't they? More frenzy means more knockdowns. The, the frenzy trap's not really a concern for them. Oh, he does have sure hands. I, I just, I, I fucking, I thought he had, oh, he's, he, so the thrower doesn't have dodge, so, oh, okay, so he hasn't got, I was, I was looking at a player with sure hands saying he didn't have sure hands, but he doesn't have sure hands and dodge on the same player, so I can get the, I can blitz the guy who hasn't got sure hands, and if he gets it on the runner, then I can bolt him. It is an absolutely fucking standard start against Norse, yeah, two removals. And he hasn't even finished his turn. Oh man, he's gone for the three dice yet, he blitz. Interesting strategy, Cotton. Gets him with block. Fuck off, as if he's got a block yet. He. <laughs> oh, shit. Fucking block yet. He. Right, he goes there, gazes him, he goes there, gazes him, he hits the ball. It's just a shame that I can't get him through because he'd have to do a dodge. So this is gonna suck a bit. Alright. He can stand up, he can stand up. One, two, three, four, five, six. He could go there and then gaze him, that could be the best play. So that now he can go to there. Oh, I was going to blitz him. I, blitzed, I literally blitzed the wrong player. I literally blitzed the wrong player. Holy shit. Well, that's good, isn't it? That's not the ball. Well, I would have rolled a one on the GFI. <laughs> There's the skull. <laughs> oh, you fucking idiot! Fuck! Good play though, wasn't it? Good play to hit the ball and then not fucking hit the ball. Pro tip, set up a great blitz on the ball then don't fucking hit the ball. Holy shit. Idiot. Anyway, hello, yeah, it's Get gone great. You little cunt. <laughs> Fuck off. <sighs> what a fucking idiot. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna not look at chat at all. <laughs> not that I'm not that I'm blaming chat, I'm blaming myself, but I need to focus up, don't I? Oh god, he pals me dodger. I've gotta focus up and try and win. Hello W R Spenny. Hello everybody. I can't believe I fucking did that. And then fucking didn't hit the ball. Holy shit, that's so bad. So bad. Double pow, brilliant. Hits me blodger, double pow's in. But I should have hit the ball. What a fucking idiot. <gasps> oh, God, how can I be that bad? Holy shit.
Night. Fucking hell. Did everything right. <laughs> and then did that wrong. Spectacularly wrong. <laughs> And he gets KO'd because of it. Brilliant. Oh, I should have knocked the ball loose, shouldn't I? Knocked the ball loose, maybe I would have got it this turn. And block him, gears him, and then run for 2D. So this is an easy 2D if I can get a power. Alright, good. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If I can get the POW and the. Um, and the gears. It's all right. No, it wasn't. I followed. Oh god, man! Concentrate, you stupid fuck! What am I even doing here? in the ball. Oh good, at least I got a push. That make up for all his removals. Oh well there you go. Broke armor seven. Stop press. Oh I got a stun as well. Two stuns, fuck. Three kills, two stuns, absolutely fucking brutal, and I fucking had two dice on the ball and didn't fucking do it. Oh! Stupid bastard. I'm so mad at myself. So bad at my- so mad at myself to set up two dice on the ball and then not fucking do it. There's just no excuse for that, is there? Wait a minute, oh he's fouling. Okay, so he's just guaranteed he's just going all in on breaking A V on the foul. He's going all in on a ducky foul. Of course he makes it. Of course it's a of course it's a remove. Full ducky foul, doesn't get sent off. Superb. So fucking perb. Kind of tempted to fucking bolt here. So I'm running out of time. I can make things happen even without a team left here. Oh, good. Right. Doesn't look that good, does it? <laughs> In my head, it went better than that. One, two, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, hand off. I think it was like then or never. I could go up there as well, couldn't I? Maybe I shouldn't have bolted then. Maybe it was tilt. Maybe it was tilt there. But. I don't know. I felt like it was at the last the last turn I could possibly use the wizard. Do you know what I mean? Like, I put so much into this and it was all going wrong. So much had gone wrong so far. I felt like maybe I could have saved it. Given up the score 1-0. And then used it to maybe, you know, score on my drive. Or... To get the turnover to win 2 1. Like score early on my drive and then go for a 2 1 win with it. With a wizard. Maybe that's what I should have done. I didn't hate the wizard. I hate the situation that's led to the wizard. Because I should have hit the fucking ball. And he hasn't failed a roll either. He hasn't failed one roll. He is getting knockdown after knockdown, removal after removal. I don't think I've even. I don't think I've failed a bloodlust. He's just fucking KO'd everybody. But now the ball's going to be in a blodger and I ain't going to be able to get him. Oh, he might fail a roll. No. Two, three, four. Now oh, he's there. GFI gaze him. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI. Hug, hug, base, base, base. That's about all I can fucking do. Hug, hug, base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Hug, hug, hug. <laughs> another block, another AV break. I mean, he's got mighty blown frenzy and block. It's not unlikely. It's just frustrating, isn't it? It's not like he's the luckiest guy in the world or anything. Or he's playing shit and I'm getting pissed off. It's just, it's just tough in it when when they don't fail anything. <laughs> it's not. It's not. St 
it's not totally un like it's not outrageous look either it's just it's not good though is it Another block, another removal. If I play, I've, I've, I've put the thing there. If I play steps, I fucking can't put it on YouTube, so I can't play steps. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. One, two, three, four, five. Six GFI GFI, all the same shit. Three, one, one, two, three, four, five, six gears. One, two, three GFI. Here we are. Double one. And we're done. <laughs> All right in the first two games. T Swizzle, not good in this game. Not good in this game at all. Every block has been an AV break that he's made. Every block that he's made has been a knockdown and an AV break. And nearly all of them have been removals. So... So this has been a really tough game. And and I fucked up. That was the biggest thing. So I can't even blame the dice for how bad it's gone because I fucked up. And I should have I should have knocked the ball loose and then who knows what might have happened then. I'd have knocked the ball loose on the first turn, he'd have been scrambling to get it, and then maybe I could have bolted it and got it and scored. So well, there's a chance of drawing two KO rolls before half time. Maybe I shouldn't use the wizard. Oh, fail the roll. <laughs> Nearly a first half pitch clear. It could be a first half pitch clear if I if I stand up my players. But still, I misplayed, didn't I? So it's still my fault. Four three two to base him. What's this? Six three two double G can I hit him? I can't even hit him. Uh, is that even worth doing? No, I've got a blitz, haven't I? Not that I can blitz. Do I just stay down and don't get Mighty Blow knocked over? He only gets to foul me once. I guess I just stay down. Yeah, a draw wasn't going to be the best result, but <laughs> I mean, a win's the best result. I had a wizard. If I'd hit the ball on, on the first turn, if I'd hit the ball on the first turn, like I should have done, then um, maybe I can use the wizard then in the scramble and then get the ball and score. You know, I could I could have seriously scored in his drive if if I'd hit the ball instead of not hitting the ball. Um, but so the the best result was definitely you know using the bolt or a vampire to turn him over and get the ball. And then maybe I could have done it again, you know. I could have been 2 0 up at half time. It was a possibility. But even if it wasn't, even Get if, fucked, you little even if it was 1 1 at half time, <laughs> maybe there was definitely a chance to win. There was a real chance to win this. It wasn't like wins. It wasn't like a draw is the best possible result at all. It was, a win was definitely on the cards pre match. Um, 
obviously the way the way the dice have gone meant that there was really no way I was stopping that. But maybe you know I, I could have still played better. And then you know, but you know after that the dice the dice killed. The dice absolutely killed it. I confused myself by moving the thrall up there. It was fucking stupid. If I hadn't moved the thrall, I would have done it. But because I'd moved the thrall there, um, I just went beside him instead of in front of him. It was really stupid. Yep, bad KOs, of course. Of course. Horrible KOs, 2 out of 7. Absolutely fucking horrible. That could have been 5 out of 7 past, couldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's true, J5. The setup was nice. The setup and the blitz was nice. But I just made a fucking dumb mistake after doing a nice setup. Well, I don't like to just blame the dice, you know. I think people who blame the dice are shit. <laughs> so, I don't want to just blame the dice. But, having said that, <laughs> I think the, the the way the dice af went after that, I didn't have much of a chance, did I? Because this is ridiculous. Um... <laughs> Yeah, moving the thrall was good, yeah. Moving the thrall was good. Moving the thrall was good, but it, it put me off. It put me off the blitz, you know, and if I hadn't done it, it wouldn't I wouldn't have been put off the blitz. It was still the right it was obviously the right move to move the blitz to move the thrall, yeah. But I just uh, it did it put me off. Oh Christ. Oh, Oh no! Oh you shit cunt! Fuck of a game! Alright, stun, brilliant. So I end the turns so and I wouldn't bite him. And then obviously he auto bites, yeah. Of course he does. Oh, hey. oh that's good, isn't it? Three out of seven. Three out of seven. So three, what was that? Two out of five, then one out of. Two out of five, then one out. Two out of seven, then one out of five. What's that? Twelve KO rolls, three passed. Brilliant. Yeah, I should have moved him so he's away, so he'd have gone. But because he was next to it, you know, in my mind, in my mind, yeah, I'm ending the turn so he runs off because I want him to run off. Um, but obviously, it's not coded that way. It auto bites. It is. It's hard, necromantic Rob. It's hard. It's very hard to stream and play. It really is. It really is. It really is hard. Um, and I could have still blitzed and run off. Yep, that's true. But I'd use my reroll. The reason is I'd use my reroll. So I thought, do you know what? I'm just going to fucking kill myself if I hit here. So I'll just run off. And then I thought I would run off. Which, you know, is unforgivably stupid. Sure. Take that on the chin. Stupid of me. Terrible. But. That's what it was. Right, now I've just got to get a touchdown. Somehow, with no players. And, um. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah, I thought I thought if I blitz, I would just double. Oh god! <sighs> what I need is a kick that gives it, lends it in two. Oh my god! I can't make a block, and the kicks in two tackle zones. Are you actually fucking shitting me here? What even is this game? Fuck. <sighs> not an easy, not the easiest match of my life. Not gonna lie. Maybe I can get a, maybe I can get, maybe I can get a quick touchdown, or maybe I can get a guy stunned and the ball in two tackle zones. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. No, I'll just blitz with him. Fuck it. One, 
two, three, four, five, six. Still balls in a cage, is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, yeah. Good enough. Balls in a good enough cage. Oh. Anyway, I can read all the chat that I missed. Four three zero. The record's incredible, and you know I've I've had some bad dices in other games, and and you know had bullshit dice to counteract it. So it's not like you know it's not it's not like the worst thing ever. It's just fucking annoying, isn't it? Right. Indistinct northern mumbling. Oh, furrow. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Right, that wasn't that wasn't that bad, was it? That wasn't that bad. That was a bad turn from him, or yeah, I think it was a bad turn from him. Oh, he did he did get the unlucky blitz thing, but still. What you mean? I could be Zagini. <laughs> It's a bit. That's a bit nasty. All right. I want the assist in there. Block him, and then. But then I can't. Then I can't hit this fucking van. Should have pushed him to there, but I didn't know I was going to stun him. So just blitz him, I guess. I really want to push forward though. Now that he. Now that it's open. GFI seems horrible. But one, two, three, four, five, six. That would give us let us stand here. Which would be really nice. Fuck it, let's go. GFI the blitz. <laughs> what an absolute fucking mad ass. Boom, got him. Oh god, even got the AV break on the jump up guy. Glorious. Go for a 1D here. It's alright, it's just the same as dodging with him, isn't it? Except with a payoff of maybe hurting um, Armour 7. And also stops me getting punched by him, so, so blocking with him was way better than dodging with him. Only down one man, really? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 3, 4, 5, 6... Oh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wow, that's incredible, isn't it? Despite five men being out. He's got three. Has he only got an 11-man team? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, he's got 12. He's got 12. I am only down one. Man. Oh, he stuns one of my... Oh, he makes the GFI with a lawny. He makes the lawny GFI, the dirty dog. <laughs> The dirty dog makes the lawn a GFI. Outrageous. Okay, oh, get out of town. I can just stall this half now, maybe. <laughs> Beast in these shitheads. Oh, brilliant. Fucking shithead Norse. The fuck off my pitch.
God, I wish I'd saved my wizard now, eh? Fuck. <laughs> maybe I can win this now. No, I'm thinking maybe I can scrape a fucking draw. <laughs> maybe I can actually scrape the draw. <laughs> Fingers crossed I can somehow scrape the miracle draw. Yeah, it did injure. Yeah, no, it was the show sure hands, but yeah, yeah, it did. It wasn't useless, but you know, it's not. It's not what you want, is it? All right, I've got an assist there, but not two. So he could blitz him, but it was easy just to dodge away. If I block, if I get a push here, then um, I would have rather pushed block with him. I'd rather block with this guy, but. The push wouldn't have been good then, would it? Whereas this is where the push frees people up. I want to dodge with him. I've got enough players. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can get quite far forward. Quite far forward. One, two, three, four, five, six. Not that far forward. But a little bit further forward than not further forward at all. Oh, I couldn't move him, could I? This is a fucking GFI now. Oh, shit. Well, I'll just one dice block with him, and then it's a, then it's him. He gets there. Yeah, that's better. Right, one dice block. Oh, oh, this guy. Oh, this is a, this is asking a lot to do all that. No, just do the one dice block. Yeah, of course it's a skull. Into a cast. Yeah, of course it is. Sure. Sure. Just needed to be, a, you know, a two plus to not fail. <laughs> Just push him away, then he can get out in here and make it quite safe. But oh no, no, I'll get Kaz instead. Yeah, the wizard did something, but I think I'd have been better off not using it. The way the way the way it went afterwards. Plus, I should have hit the ball when I set up the ball hit. <laughs> Another removal. Not easy, is it? I think we're getting to potato turn. Oh, you fuck. Oh, well, I've got a five. Oh, 
<laughs> Baby! Come to butthead. Glorious. One, two, three, four, five, six. So. The three plus without a reroll is looking grim, isn't it? But it's like all I can do. Of course it fails. There's basically no chance of a 3 plus working. And then I would have gone for the, the GFIs with him after that. <laughs> another knockdown, another AV break. But again, he's like 90 odd percent knockdown, isn't he? So it's not, it's not crazy. And then he's over 50% AV break. So it's not crazy or anything. It's not like I'm infuriated by it, but it's just annoying, isn't it? Maybe I should have tried to just get him up, but then I'm thinking if I bloodlust, then I've got to do some shit dodges to not do anything. Reroll this, obviously. No! Wow! Wow! <laughs> he didn't reroll that. Outrageous. I mean, he finally fucking makes that. Oh. Right, so what's this? Just a dodge two dice and then move? Can't, if, he, if, if he'd failed him, I could have dodged and tried to gaze him, couldn't I? Might as well do that. I could blitz him and then go one... If I get the POW, one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI. But I think doing it, oh, I don't know. The fact that I need to do a two plus first. Three plus, and then hit him, and then one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know, I think this is maybe better. Maybe better, look, I've got time, I've got three minutes. Let's go to Samba. Let's go to Samba Action Calculator. So we need the two plus for Bloodlust, which I have to make. And then a two die. The thing is, if I get a push, then it's going to be a three plus and a thing. So, yeah, and it's only 50% to get the push. So, no, I'll just go this way. I'll just go this way. Phew. Push him. Good. Right. Might scrape a draw. If you score bloodlust, does matter. Yeah, little Baz, you don't get to score if you've bloodlusted. Three out of five, unbelievable. So what's that? Six out of seventeen isn't isn't ridiculous anymore, is it? It's only two less than or th two and a half less than what would be, you know, uh, normal if you like. And all the reserves mean that this is like a real team, and his isn't. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He's got eight. Three, six, ten. Ten versus eight. I've only got two turns, though, to turn him over and score. I'm not going to score. Realistically. That's true, Mipa. Yeah, I just think trying to stop him is probably better than trying to uh, trying to get set up a bit further forward. This is in range with four GFIs, isn't it?
I just want to try and stop him. So it's stupid to try and go for the turn over. Oh god, yeah, pitch invasion, whole team stunned, that'd be pretty good. If I had the wizard, if I had the wizard still, if I'd scored a turn earlier. But still, a draw, I'll be happy with a draw. <laughs> if I get a draw out of this, I'll be fucking happy, to be fair. Nice weather. Deep kick? No, not really. Perfectly in line for him. And he's got three turns to score, so... Thanks, Mitra. Uh, any vamps? Oh, yeah, yeah, there's been some... There's been some level vamps. But a blodger, two dodgers, and the other one's got block. But... Unfortunately, this blodger has scored scored the touchdown because you know he's the best, so he gets the ball. So that makes it a bit shit. Oh, this is a bit bad, isn't it? The the pow the push then pow into uh, basing three guys. Yeah, random boy. My team isn't as good as yours. I have not got random boy levels of level ups. <laughs> oh, as if I'm gonna go for it, eh? As if I'm gonna just actually go for it. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Swarming the ball seems quite reasonable. One, two, three, four, five. Well, one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. To try and stop, protect him. I don't know. These are both hit. He's got Dauntless anyway. No, he's Berserker. Where's the Dauntless guy? Is he fucked? Oh, yeah, he is. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, or just whack him in here. Yeah, I wasn't going to activate him, and he was going to be the safety. Yeah, Skuro, that was the idea, but then I activated him and KO'd my own guy. So now I don't have a fucking safety. Maybe he should have, maybe he should have tried the dodges and stuff. Because, yeah, he's just going to free up these players by hitting... I thought he could free up the Yeti, but you just using the Yeti to free them up was better anyway, wasn't it? But it's hard, because all of his guys are, are based. Base, 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 base. Oh my god, you lucky bastard, random boy. 
<laughs> it's not an insult, by the way. <laughs> it's just a jokey, you lucky bastard. Ogres is the dream, isn't it? Because they just can't protect the ball at all. <laughs> the worst team at protecting the ball in the game. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good team to get. No, it was a friend. That was a friendly thing that you say to your friends, isn't it? You lucky bastard and stuff. It's just a friend. It is a friendly. It is a 50 50 pickup. He could fail it. He could fail the 50 50. No, he couldn't. Of course, he couldn't fucking fail a 50 50. He could fail the 50 50 handoff. No, of course, he couldn't fucking fail the 50 50 fucking handoff. He could fail the Dodgers and the GFIs. He could. It's possible, isn't it? As if he made all these fucking rolls. Holy shit. If I had a bolt, I could just fully win here. <laughs> and just bolt him, block, pick it up, pass. Now, as it is now, I'm going to have to fucking try and get this away. What is this? How has this even happened? What even is this? What even is this absolute bullshit here? Every fucking roll under the sun. Fuck off. You know I'm not going to knock him over. I mean, you just fucking know it, don't you? <laughs> Holy shit. Why? How? How is that a thing? Every fucking roll under the sun, no problem. Two dice a guy, can't even do it. Can't even just fucking two dice a guy. Fuck me. I really want to double G if I think that's better than the dodge. But then if he goes there, then I can tag everybody at least. That's a 4-3, whereas this would be a 4-4-3. Four, four, so this dodge is better payoff, and the double G if I is only marginally better. So... One, two, three, four, five, six, so yeah, him there. There you go. Why not hit no? Oh yeah, I didn't hit no because I blitzed. Thought it was stupid when I wasn't. I hypno the oath. No, oh, yeah. On a four plus. Yeah, so he could have tagged him. If he could have reached. And then I could have gone in there. But then he could have freed him up. I wanted I wanted to, you know, make him roll that. I'll score now for sure. Fuck's sake, man. 
I can't believe he did all of that and then I just couldn't fucking two dice. Him. That's some absolute bullshit. I mean, that is. Hey! Oh, he's got a re roll, though. Fuck. Hey! <laughs> oh, it's a shame he didn't die. Oh, he got injured. Oh, it's a shame it wasn't a death. Brilliant. Classic justice. Fuck you, Norse. Get Fucking ain't Norse. Little cunt. <laughs> Fuck off. Fucking Norse. I mean, that was obviously very unlucky that he won in 36, but holy shit, the rolls before. The rolls before that he made. And plus, there were all those rolls, if he'd failed at any of them, the ball was on the floor with a vamp ready to get it to another vamp. Like, it was crazy how close he was to losing that. Oh, God. Oh, and that throw got the MVP as well, just to, just to, just to make that. The random death took the MVP. Wow. That was so risky going for the win. I mean, he had, you know, he was right to go for the win, but it was risky because if he'd failed though, the handoff and the pickup and everything and all the dodges and everything that he was making, if he'd failed any of them, I had two vampires to pick it up, pass, and score. 17, 13, 15. So slightly bad. Um, the dodges, I did make some three pluses, to be fair. But I did double one and did fail every three plus. The gazes were poor, but I guess some were four pluses. The bloodlust were poor, but there you go. Um, the wake up after KOs ended up not that bad, did they? The GFIs were good. But the biggest thing was my misplay of not blitzing the ball. If I blitzed the ball, I got six AV breaks and he got 22. It's fucking crazy, this game. <laughs> Breaking your own guys with fucking bloodlust is horrible. Oh no, I only did five. One was... Uh, I may be even re-rolling, maybe I only broke my own armor four times. It's fucking crazy breaking your own armor, it's this horrible mechanic. But, um, yeah, that was... I feel like I didn't really deserve to lose that. Yeah, imagine the game I'd have hit the ball on turn two, exactly. You know, I feel like I didn't deserve to lose that, so... You know, I'm not saying that I fully outplayed him and deserved to win, but I would have felt hard done by by a loss for sure. With all those rolls. And it was so close to being a win after making all the GFIs to get the scoring threats. I think I'll keep the movement five um, for now until I go over 150. So yeah, the team's looking... <laughs> looking that not bad. Um, right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.